Hello and welcome back to our FCS Dynasty and NCAA Football 2006. Today we've got the Texas State Bobcats traveling to take on the UC Davis Aggies. Now before the game, I would like to talk about something. The Winter Brigade, one of my subscribers, suggested that we have a YouTube or a Discord fan page for my YouTube channel. And so I went ahead and made one of those. If you guys would like to join that, go on my channel and click on the Discord icon as Trey Henry III gets an interception, his first of his career. Just click on that uh, Discord icon and join. I will be in the channel. You guys can talk to me about my current series that we got going on here on the channel. NFL football, college football, just anything under the sun. If you guys want to join and talk to me or other fans of this channel, just go ahead and join that Discord channel. I think I said channel about 30 times. But anyways, let's get into the game now as Higgins gets an interception. And UC Davis uh, defense is looking pretty good so far today. And they do have a nasty defensive line. Fourth and five for the Aggies. They're going to go for it, and it's a good decision because Bell is wide open. Inside the five, or the ten, and he fumbles the football. So the Aggies give it right back. Uh, in the weekly prediction video, I predicted UC Davis would win this ball game 35-31. to I do think the Bobcats have some really good talent on offense, especially with their 80 overall quarterback with 80 speed. And here's a nice run from Chase, picking up eight yards. But I do think UC Davis um, has a fantastic defense. I think they're going to be really tough to beat this year for a lot of these FCS schools. But there's a great play to Nash past the 30-yard line. And Cummings crushed. He fumbles the football. That is the first career forced fumble for Andrew Jackson. And Elijah Christian gets his first career fumble recovery. And if you guys noticed the Heisman cheese, it did not allow me to return this fumble, which would have been a touchdown. You see that? <laughs> kind of just froze Christian in space right there. Owen Black taking off. He's going to pick up the first down and more out of bounds at the 45-yard line. If you guys get this video to 20 or 25 likes today, in the next few hours, I will post our final game for week one, which is VMI taking on Wyoming. As Owen Black picks up another first down on the ground. Tyreek Taylor untouched into the end zone for his first career rushing touchdown. He's playing full, uh, fullback for the Aggies. He is the second string halfback. He lost the battle in the spring game. And that pass should have been picked off by Turner. But he decided not to jump. But Tyreek Taylor is a monster. And that pass is almost intercepted by Trey Henry the third. First and ten for the Aggies. Owen Black looking electric with that speed. Throws a nice touch pass over to Jaquan Brown. Right over the middle. Nine-yard pickup. Lito Lozano up the gut to the 46-yard line. Black taking a shot right side. Deflected away at the last second. He wanted to find Brown but did not connect. They punt the ball away. Bobcats back on offense here. Nice catch and run for Vogel. Cummings taken down for a loss of three. That was Elijah Christian, his second tackle for a loss on the day. Bobcats still looking for their first points of the game, and they might get it on this drive as they connect to Johnson here to the 42-yard line. Cummings pitches back. Chase has it, and Andrew Jackson stops that run before it gets going. And a nice play here. From number 55, Zachary Hyde, the middle linebacker. Owen Black to Lozano. Breaking a tackle down to the 31-yard line. I think the only thing that's going to hurt this team at all this season is maybe the secondary. Because they only have a safety. There's no corner help. So here's a great play by Gatlin. He's going to score. Juking out a couple defenders. But there's a flag. And the play doesn't count. I'm sorry, Sam. But that was a great play. Lozano up the gut in the open space, taken down. Great tackle in the open field. Lozano up to 65 yards. And another great throw here from Owen Black up to the 48-yard line as the Aggies look to score before the half is over. 
Black going to take off. Nope, pulls up to throw it, and Jaquan Brown comes down with it inside the 20-yard line for the first down. Lozano taking this one right side inside the 5 to the 4-yard line. And then he punches it in for his first career rushing touchdown. So both halfbacks have a touchdown today. Now this was the last game I recorded with my old recording device. And there's the first career sack for Andrew Jackson. And that'll end the first half. 17-0, Aggies on top. But the remainder of the games are on my Elgato. There's a nice catch and run by Bell to the 43. Fourth and one, Tyreek Taylor gets the first down. Nope, they say he did not get the first down. Great stop by the Bobcats. But the ending of this game, it actually took me about four hours to play just the fourth quarter because the recording device kept dropping hundreds and hundreds of frames after about 20 seconds of recording. And there was some great blocking down the field by Sam Gatlin getting a couple pancake blocks. And a couple of these plays, you will see, I had to go on an instant replay to capture them. So that recording device is toast. Lozano getting loose inside the 10, down to the seven yard line. From here on out, the game is really choppy. Drop frames, Owen Black, parting of the Red Sea, walks into the end zone for an easy seven yard touchdown run. Was a designed option, but the linebacker was just sitting there taking a nap. Chase with a nice juke, picking up a first down, breaking a tackle before Hyde brings him down. You'll also notice the sound does not match up with the video itself. I do apologize for that, guys. And that pass hits the grass. Aggies take back over on offense. Lozano getting loose again past midfield to the 45-yard line. He's looking pretty good so far. And so is Tyreek Taylor, who just picked up eight. Third and one. Taylor makes sure he picks that first down up, but he fumbles the football. Luckily, Lito Lozano was there to recover. And then he'll take it inside the 20-yard line. Great run. They have 140 yards up the gut today. And there's a holding call. That'll wipe out an 8-yard run by Tyreek Taylor. Option play to the right. Owen Black taking off. Look at how fast that young man is. Breaking a tackle as well. And getting it down to the 3-yard line. Showing some strength at the end of that run. And Lozano takes the toss. Uses his speed. Finds the edge. And finds the end zone. Aggies pouring it on here, 31-0. I predicted a 35-31 victory for the Aggies. I did not expect this to happen as Turner gets a pick, returns it to the 15-yard line. Aggies threatening again. Lozano taking it right side. Jukes dives for the pylon, and he's got the end zone again. Um, and then he gets another touchdown here, four touchdowns. In the game for Lito Lozano. And 45 nothing is the final. We have our first shutout in the dynasty. And it comes by way of the UC Davis Aggies. And their defensive line just controlled the game. All game, really. Some great plays by the linebackers. Interception for Trey Henry. Some non-subscriber players stepped up on defense as well. Owen Black played a great game on offense. 340 yards on the ground for the Aggies. One lost fumble, no picks. We finally have our first victory in this dynasty. Black, 7 of 13, 127 yards, sacked one time. Lozano goes for 209 with four touchdowns. Owen Black at 97, Tyreek Taylor with 34. Everybody had a touchdown, but Lozano had four. Jaquan Brown, 46 yards. And Sam Gatlin had that huge touchdown reception that was wiped out, so he did not have a catch today. But he had four pancakes. He was hungry. Andrew Jackson led the team in tackles with six. Hyde and Christian both get four. Trey Henry gets three. Tyreek Taylor had two as well, and so did Chubb. The defensive tackle. We have one sack today. That was Andrew Jackson. Four picks. Two by Anthony Turner, the strong safety. He stepped up big time. Three pass deflections. A forced fumble for Andrew Jackson. 
a force uh, fumble recovery for Elijah Christian. Kick return and a punt return for Jaquan Brown. Nothing big, nothing major. Well, this was definitely not expected. I did not see a 45 to zero win for the Aggies in this uh, season opener. But the next Aggies football game will be will be against the Citadel Bulldogs. That'll be out next week. If you guys want to see VMI take on Wyoming, I need 20 likes today, and I will post that video in a few hours. But I hope to see you guys then. Take it easy, guys.